Hey GTI fans, welcome back to another episode of Empyrean Galactic Survival. This is your host Zlot, and we are here today doing the Alpha 8 Experimental. So, build 1649, um, basically a tiny little bug fix update was today. It's not going to change anything other than just some fog of war adjustment stuff which by the way the fog of war I think is amazing so let's say I'll show you what I've I went around uh, after the last episode and oh okay so this is the new the new fog of war okay so it's completely opaque on starter planets now I'm okay with that that's fine that's absolutely fine. Um, and so what they're going to do is they're going to make it um, translucent on planets that you've landed on. So with a either, I guess not a drop pod. Drop pod doesn't count. But um, yeah, so you can see there's some areas that we haven't quite uncovered. So I did, I did really good using the radar and fog of war combination. I was able to uncover a whole bunch of stuff. I, as I was uncovering, I was also leveling because of all the uh, dudes. So over here, I was able to, you can see there's the Titan here, uh, a whole bunch of resources still left on the map. So originally, where are we here? Where's the, uh, Where's our base? Where's our base? Where's our base? Down here. So originally, I headed this way, I believe. Yeah. I cut across, and it triggered for me when I came to here. I ended up um, spotting all this stuff, and then I came across and kept going, spotted power station stayed away you know got and also I I ended up mining out a whole bunch of stuff too this is all using biofuel until I got up to here and so this is in the um, so I went way up I just kept going on an angle and ended up discovering this stuff here some ruins anyway I came up this way Discovered the iron, then found the Prometheum in this uh, radiated biome area here. Now, they said that one of the updates was there's supposed to be less spiders around the Prometheum. I didn't find any less spiders. I found them to be just as many. So, I don't know. I am on hard settings too, and I did not regenerate the play field. So, maybe the spawners are still built uh, maybe there's more spawners still on my play field than what, what if I had started again, but I'm not going to start again. Uh, maybe one of the release candidates or something, the final release candidate or second final, I don't know, but we'll see. Anyway, I was able to get some of the Prometheum out of here, which basically, uh, actually, no, there's three, there's three of them in here. I actually mined one out. And got a big chunk, a good chunk of another one out of here. We got a bunch of various stones, cobalt and little promethium stones in these biomes. We also found the Xeno mainframe, the alien watchtower. So I'm assuming the uh, Robson protocol stuff is right in around here. Uh, we came up around, uncovered some more, pro another big promethium there. So there's, there's a bunch of promethium up here to, to mine. But I don't want to do it with the H... V anymore although the HV was awesome especially once we got it to level 10 so we this is what we uncovered we uncovered a whole bunch of stuff so we found, found Titan uh, unfortunately the armory is really close to this one so we might have to deal with that somehow and those are smaller Prometheum deposits but that's okay I want to get to the Titan and uh, and multi-tool them down so we haven't completely uncovered everything on the map. Also, 
I have two abandoned mines on the seed. So one of the abandoned mines is there, and the other one is where the heck is it now? Our station, right there. Yeah. So two abandoned mines, both of them with a bunch of resources around them, and I think that's how it spawns in in the uh, play field. When you look at the play field, it spawns resources around it. Um. So yeah. So. We've got some adventuring areas here that we can check out that are fairly close to us here. So the village and the abandoned mine. Uh, I'm not not probably going to even bother doing the abandoned mine this series because eh, you guys have probably seen walkthroughs of it a billion times now. I'm sure it has not changed. Uh, and we'll probably end up doing it in the Iron Man series anyway coming up. I'm sure. So what I want to do is I want to do... POIs that we haven't actually really seen yet. So we've seen the small wreckages, we found the wreckage, we've we've done the alien tower with the Robson protocol. Um, ruined landing pad. So interesting. There's a couple of ruined. So there's a bunch. Oh, there's the shrine too. So that was floating. This big floating shooty POI with a bunch of turrets, like it, it actually had some nasty turrets, uh, and it's a floater. <laughs> okay. Um, yeah, so we've got lots of regular shooty POIs, non-shooty POIs. We've got a bunch of area here that we haven't discovered yet, um, and a bunch, a bunch in the pole area here, so, so there is a lot of of stuff. We also found some good golem spawns in the sandy areas and uh, that's really good because I was able to get a whole bunch of neo and some sath uh, which enabled me to so I'll show you oops here let's go like this I'll show you we spawned in the camo hut again I I had that in the last series you'll see I, I it's not that big of a deal, but what I was able to do was a, I was able to upgrade to Advanced Constructor right off the bat because of those uh, the loot from the Golem. So you can see I got a ton of stuff. That's because, and you can see I've got a ton of stuff cooked up, including a bunch of the new HV stuff. So what I want to do today is I actually want to upgrade the HV. So I cooked up a whole bunch of stuff. And I'll show you this HV actually, the starter HV that I that I built in in creative and spawned in here was actually quite amazing. I was actually really happy with it. Oh my god. And it it handles really well for minimal thrusters. I ended up upgrading it as I went. So I'm a, as I was traveling around the planet, I ended up upgrading it because you could make everything that it needed in the in its constructor so really cool I love that yeah I upgraded it on the way to the point where um, I, I need to I needed a good constructor to to really build the rest of it because I just had so much volume on all the thrusters and stuff that I want to put on it so that's what we're gonna do today this thing performed admirably this this actually drill um, layout right here worked really, really well. I thought this was these were going to get stuck. They never did because I guess the uh, hover engines were on the end of them, so they never actually got stuck. The hover engines were always pushing them off. And, yeah, it was, it was quite amazing how it, how it performed, how it actually dug up. I... I I dug up a whole bunch of, well, you could see how much stuff I had. I dug up a whole bunch. I mean, I'm down to not so many copper anymore. Some sil uh, still a good amount of silicone and promethium um, and iron. I think I dug out three of the iron. Yeah, I, think I dug out two or three of everything basically, except for the promethium. I only got like one and a half in, I think. Um, so yeah, we haven't uncovered all everything yet. I mean, we still got a whole bunch of silicone to uncover and iron. That's just kind of weird. Okay. But 
today we're just gonna we're gonna give Eve this thing even more love because it got more love in this latest update with the with the medic medical station and cloning station which is super awesome so we've got a medic station for the hv and a clone chamber for the hv now and my design here is gonna is just working so well in in alpha 8 i'm 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 I just, I couldn't be happier how this thing is turning out. Um, so I think what we want to do is we want to really beef this thing up now. So let's, let's put on some really heavy thrusters now. We're going to put, we're going to put some more gear inside here. <clears throat> but first of all, we got to strip a bunch of stuff off and then we'll put it into symmetry mode so the I really like that drill layout that actually worked quite well so I might just leave it like that and I'm just gonna pop the the trusses off and I want to double up on the blocks too so I'll be I'll be popping a bunch of stuff off yeah Okay, so let's start instead of talking. Let's just do this. This will be a long episode. Well, uh, you know what? I'll, I'll break it into two episodes because this is going to take at least an hour and a half, two hours to do. It's just the way it is. So I was able to make myself a T2, a couple of T2 drills and a T2 multi-tool. So really, really happy about that. And I'm going to retrieve blocks because I'm going to put these back inside my factory for spawning in the next SV I do. So I just want to remove these for now. And realistically, I want to get rid of those crappy thrusters there. And... I need to get rid of that inventory full. Oh crap. Okay, so. Okay. Well, let's put some stuff away. Where did I drop that right in front of me? That's okay, I got a second here. Can I get into here? Yeah, so now we actually can actually go into the control panel with our, with our, a. Uh, drones again so I'm super happy about that that is huge uh, okay so let's just put this stuff away what do we got here do we have a cargo box yes so we can just go like this come on and we'll put that in there for now and that in there um, yeah, we don't need all this. That, and that, that, that. We don't need that. We don't need that. Put that in there. That, that. Okay. Okay. So let's grab that before it disappears. Because we want that. And we'll take that one. And we'll take this off, because we'll put it back on later. And we'll get rid of all these. And realistically, I want to get rid of all of the stuff off the back here, too. So I'm just going to redo this whole thing. And is anything in there? Yeah. Okay, so some loot. What was this stuff from? Oh, this is from one of the POIs the, that didn't even have a core in it. I, was, I just plopped a core. Or no, did it have a core? What was that from? That was... What was that from? Oh, that was this thing. Where is it? That was this, the alien watchtower. I was actually 
I was far enough away from the fortifications to just get in there and pop its core and take the uh, <laughs> take some of the gear out of it. Uh, but if I got too close into it, I couldn't get all the way into it with my because it would actually get shot at by a homing missile and it took out a big chunk of the tower getting to me this homing missile turret one of the fortifications so that was fun I, I was actually gonna I, I almost put that on camera because I was gonna record that it's like ah it's not that it's only, it was only a few minutes long and right now I still gotta rebuild my computer to get all my software working again so let's just we'll, we're just gonna break it into smaller episodes here so let's get rid of that we don't need that don't need that 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 uh, that don't need that don't need that that okay So now, a lot of this stuff will just stack with the other stuff, right? So, we do want to take all the fuel out, so let's take that out, grab that, grab that, grab these. Is there anything in here? Nope. Grab that, we'll grab the ammo, grab that, and nothing in there now, grab that. Uh, okay, now let's put our light on. Anything in here? Yeah, a thousand bullets. Okay, good. We'll grab that. Okay, so now... Oh. Um, I'm going to take this off. I know I'm, I'm wasting ammo, because they were like full, but that's okay. We've got, we've got a decent supply of mats right now. Now I think I'm going to change this up here, and I'm going to open this up and redo these blocks, because I'm doing this all thicker anyway. So let's go into here. Where is our Go into here and we'll do put what do we want to put in there? Not really sure. Oh here. Put the concrete blocks, put the rocket saw. Uh we'll put the thrusters in there for now because we we'll pull them out and put them put them in the factory later. Okay, so that's all HV stuff. Okay. Okay. Let's pop these blocks off, the ones that are angled, because they're going to be different blocks. So we're going to retrieve those blocks, so we're just going to take that that um okay just want to take care of all these angled blocks that are in the wrong spot now before we put a symmetry plane on Okay, uh, is that it? Angle, no, angle blocks here. Get rid of those. Okay, are we ready for the symmetry plane? I think we might be. Nope, right there. Okay. Is everything removed now? It looks like it. And we don't have much space left. Okay, so I think what we want to do now is get a symmetry plane going. 
So we'll hit N and we'll do symmetry plane. We want to do the YZ plane and then we want to go into the center of the cockpit here. Is that right? No, that's not it. So we want the center of the cockpit. So we're going to do this again here. And then I'll turn it back on and right there. That looks right. There we go. Okay. Okay, now I think we have the same symmetry of blocks removed. Do we not? So that goes down two, that goes down. Okay. Okay. Okay, so let's first start off with our steel blocks. I guess we need to fill this back in. So we're going to do that. And well, those are angled too. Do we need to get rid of those? Do we need those anymore? You know what? We'll keep we'll keep the angled ones on the inside. It doesn't really matter. It's more for looks anyway. Okay, so is this gonna look weird? How am I gonna do this? <sighs> Doesn't really line up very well. Hmm. to see what we can do here. Can we... Well, actually, this might not be too bad. We might be able to get away with something like this. And then... on an angle now. Uh, so how do we want to do this? God, that's... I mean, sadly, that is sealed. It doesn't look like it, but it is. We can... I guess we can go like this and reseal it up. Right? So it'll look it'll look sealed from the outside then, right? Yeah. Um hmm. Do I want it like that though? You know what? I'm thinking let's do some angles here. Let's cut that back again. Let's cut that back. So I think what I want. We do full slope here. Yeah, that's not too bad. That's not too bad. It kind of contours with it. Um, Okay, and then what do we do here? I guess we do that. We'll fill that in with a block. We what do we do here? I think this gets filled in with as a block, right? Yeah. Okay. So that also gives the cockpit a little bit more protection. And can't get 
pass for some bizarre reason. <laughs> okay. Um, now, do we do? What do we do there? Let's go. Nope. Come on. Nope. Nope. You're gonna be silly, are ya? Do we go? Okay. Well, let's try. Can we get? Oh, I had it for a second. Come on. There we go. And then, whoa. No, come on. No. <laughs> okay. Let's try this. Is it filling it right in? I'm not sure. Let's go around to this side. Well, it has to be because of the symmetry plane, right? Okay, and then we want, what do we want here? So now we want this to start coming out on an angle, right? Yeah, so let's put this here. Stop it. There, okay. There and there. And then we want this and this. And then we kind of want that to continue now because I'm going to put the other. That's only, okay, so that's only one layer. Ooh. Is that going to be too far back? Once I put another one, that's going to be right there. Is that going to be okay? No. I think we need to do this further ahead. Start this here. Start this here, yeah. Okay. Let's nuke this. And that. And we'll just put a regular block in here. Okay, and then then here we can start out. Like this. So we'll go like that. And and this is just going to be blocks right here. Okay. And then we want we want that again there. And then this is going to be blocks again. Yep. Whoa, 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 whoa. Hey. Okay, that's just super loud and annoying. You know what? I'm going to fix that. Okay, now <laughs> continue on. Um, now I am going to want to put, okay, so that's that's cool. We'll have that coming out. That or even more pronounced. Not sure how that would all tie in, but I don't think it really matters at this point. Um, hmm. I don't want the I don't want the pontoon too far back. Is it gonna be okay if I Uh, 
I gotta try and figure out how to do this here because it's it's not the way I want it to work. It's not working the way I want it to work. What do I want? I want this bottom corner to be different. How are we gonna make that different? That's gotta slope up. So that means we need something like this, right? Like this? Is this going to work? Mm -hmm. No. I don't know what I'm doing there. That's not going to work. Um... <laughs> Oh crap, I forgot to nuke all that, so that's just, we're just nuking that, okay. So we're trying to figure that out, right? We need... What we need is... Oh wait, that would have worked. Hang on, I just had it going the wrong way. I just had it the wrong way. We need... Yeah, yeah, this will work. Like this, and then I spin this. Like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No. No, I have no clue. <laughs> no, does that just look stupid? What? Now I. Goes up on an angle. You know what? You know what? We just. If we're gonna if we're gonna angle it, we're just gonna angle it. So let's just do that. Yeah. Yeah, we're just gonna angle it. We're going to angle it. Knock those off. So we're going to start with a... Now, should we keep the sharp edge angle look? Oops. I think so. like this yeah let's let's see and then we'll put uh, one of these guys on come on uh, there there that's actually not too too bad that still might be too far back we'll see if I'm if I'm grinding it if I'm hitting on the front too much when I'm traveling then I know they're too far back okay so the back ones get them there for now okay now what I want to do with them is I want to do a two tier okay this is going to be interesting so I should do I should do just straight blocks here I think now straight blocks here oops yeah and then so I need to put gear in here too 
but I need to actually finish this wall off. So let's just go like that for now, okay? And then we'll knock those out. That's not a big deal. So pop that and that and that and that for now. We'll might be adding them back in later, but for now we'll just pop them out. Okay. Okay. Got something going here. We've got something. We've got something. Um. You know what? I'm I'm gonna make this whole thing angled right here. Yeah. Starting right here. Absolutely. So we can we can do the angle piece here, right? We can do this one, and we just rotate it like that. Yeah, yeah. That way it can, we can continue on with the angle stuff properly, and then we'll just go like this. Boom. Okay. So this needs to come up one more, I think. Whoops, 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 whoops. Didn't mean to do that. Drop all my steel blocks. <coughs> hmm. I don't know if the drills are going to work properly now in that configuration. I might have to pull one out, pull one out of that config, and I probably pull these end ones out and move them maybe a little further in. I might have to do that. We'll see. We'll see. Maybe not. Maybe not. I'll just use, uh, I'll just make sure I got RCS'd up the yin yang. Okay. So we want, we want a block there, yep. And then we want that just to come straight down like that to match up, yep. And then we want, what do we want there? We want a piece like this. Yep, that totally matches, okay. And then from here we want, I think we want a straight slanted nose piece with this. Okay, and that, that'll actually work there too if we do this. And then continue with that. Nice, so you can still see the cockpit from outside. Okay, and then, is that the one? Is that the right piece there? I don't, I don't think so. Ooh, that one's gonna be hard to, to match up. It's two different angles. <clears throat> okay, so, how are we gonna do this? That looks like a full block goes in there. And then we do this angle now, 
right? Yeah. Okay. So, how many blocks is that? One, two, three. Perfect. So we can put a turret right here. Now, let's... Yeah, I think... Yeah, I think we can go like this. Yeah, here we go. There we go. We got we got a match here. I think we can do this. So we'll go like this. And nope, that's not going to work. Um, or is it? We can go... We can go like this, I think. Yeah, that'll look cooler. There we go. That's not bad. That's not boxy looking. Too bit too boxy looking. <laughs> okay, it's a little boxy looking. Um, but we can do stuff to. M we can pull this out wider. No, if we make it too much wider, it's going to be harder to to mine with. Okay, so. We need to put gear in here. So what I'm thinking is these are going to be side things here. This is where all the stuff is going to go. Because I want to pop this out. That's right. Bound and determined to make a back hatch work somehow or another. Okay, so we'll get this figured out. We'll get this figured out. Hmm. It's quite large, isn't it? Did I do too many there? Might have done too many. I think we can just stretch this out now. Let's... Actually, we shouldn't need to. Let's, um... Let's start... Climbing up here. Like this. Oh, that scared the bejesus out of me. Shooting at spiders, I bet. Over there, somewhere, probably. Probably. <laughs> okay. Um, okay, we can put regular block there. So... Let's take a look and see what this looks like. And then we put regular blocks. Let's pull these out three by three. Okay. <clears throat> and then we're going to go up again. Okay. And then we're just going to. Come on. Fill that out. Okay, this thing is wide load. Oh yeah, this should be interesting. We'll see if this is actually gonna be viable. I might it might be too wide now. Usually the wider it is, the more stable. I 
really kind of want those further forward, but that's okay. So three, three by three platforms for turrets. That's actually works out really well like that. Okay. So let's, let's fill this in. Yikes. I'm not sure about that. <laughs> huh. It's very jagged looking. I might be able to do something with that, maybe. Wonder if I can Wonder if I can round the corners a bit. I doubt it. I don't think so. We can try though. So we can do something like um, we can do something like what have we got here? Sixteen left. That's it. Holy crap. Do something like that. That won't work there, though. Well, it doesn't look bad, though. It doesn't look bad. It gets rid of a little bit of a sharp there. Okay. Can I do that to all of them? Is there a way to do that to all of them? Let's see. Let's get rid of that one. Get rid of that one. That one. That one. Ah. Uh. Then that one, that one, that one, and that one. That way I can go How can I go? How can I go? <laughs> I can go what, Z lot? I can go what? What if I hang on? What about what about if I just do something like like that, and then continue? Oh, we can't really continue that all the way. Um, oh wait, I'm thinking of this wrong again. Yeah, let's have it like this. Like that. There we go. Some funky angles. And then that can just be flat. Um, hmm, not too sure about that now. <laughs> uh, I'm 
let's see. Makes it less, it makes it a little bit more angle, angular. Okay, need to fill that in. And that's it for blocks. Okay, I think uh, this is uh, a good spot to leave off this episode we've got a good chunk of the build done it's kind of a wide short body we'll see how it performs with uh with a whole whack of jet thruster so we're going to put be putting a whole whack of gear in either side and then we're going to have interior gear for the inside here for us to use while we're inside uh, i might have to i might have to move this back a little bit further to accommodate some of the gear uh, so we'll see. We, we might have to do that next episode. So, yeah, next episode we will continue this. So until then, you guys have yourselves an awesome, awesome day.